over there sure. is uh, informing Spooky of the player named right now. Oh, it's Rula. Oh, uh, yeah, it's Rula versus Sweet. Oh, okay. So these are the advancement matches from the couple of matches ago. <laughs> well, he has the name. He has his name right on the uh, right on his shirt. Does he? I, I, yeah, he does. I didn't even see it. <laughs> I only just noticed it. All right, Brinstar Depths, new counter yes. picks. Gentlemen's claws, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> if both the, players agree yeah. to a stage, they can actually play on there, it. There is a real rule where if two players agree on any stage, they can play on it. They can play on Rainbow Cruise or Icicle Mountain. Rainbow or, Cruise is fair, yeah. man. Yeah. I'm, I'm old school. I'm from the MLG days. Oh, me too. I mean, Corneria can dip. That's obviously not fair. But <laughs> <laughs> the other ones, I missed them. All right. So Rula did really good previously against... Uh, Tico, I believe. Yeah, Tico. The Peach player. And uh, he was really good at staying away from the damage and staying on the platforms. Let's see if uh, Sweep, who was able to deal with that just fine when Prozac was doing it, can uh, punish accordingly now that it's Rula doing it. Oh. Yeah. Doesn't this quite is a combo opportunity. Yeah. Oh. He gets a little anxious there trying to punish Sheik on the ledge. Right, nice double shine. shine. Gets him off the top of the stage. Very nice double shine by Rula. Ooh. Oh, Sheik with a merciless edge guard. See, that's the thing with spaces. They automatically want to say, uh oh, I got hit. I'm going to up B as soon as possible. Especially with Falco, because his recovery is so short. And Sheik uses yep. that to her advantage. Says, all right, you're right there. I'm coming for you. Ooh, very nice. Yep. And that's why people argue that this matchup is so even. Because even though Falco kind of destroys her on the stage in the neutral game, all it takes is for her to get him off stage for one second. And she can... It theoretically cover 95% of the options and yeah. almost and always Gimp Falco. You know, and it looks kind of easy to Gimp Falco when he's trying to recover when you watch, you know, more competent players, but it's actually not that easy because you have to react very quickly to whatever option he's got at the moment, especially if he's recovering from on high and he wants to do the, uh, the upbeat sweet spot to ledge. Yep, definitely. Okay, sweet, so getting some uh, tech chase grab. Rula trying to end them with an up air, but sweet. DI'ing properly. Oh. Unfortunately, it goes for a non optimal punish on the up B, and Sweet is able to live, but gets a great falling there through the platform, and just like that, he evens out the game. Not sure what Sweet was going for right there, just kind of ran up and stood there. Rula's pressure has been pretty spot on. It seemed a little sloppy versus Tico, but I think it was just uh, the fact that it's Peach and he can't really combo her as much. So he was playing a little more patient, but this match, yeah, he looks much more has solid. Been, has been really good. Oh wow! Sheik, thanks for the grab, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> I was almost gone to my to my death. Oh yeah, Ooh. that's the just that one mistake. That's that we were old talking about earlier. Sheik, right there, double jump there off the ledge. Yeah, Sweet's so perfectly content with just hanging out now. Getting the Shino stall going. Here, take these, take the 17, take that 22. <gasps> Hold this, and you're done. All right. oh, okay. Goes down for the gimp. Says, you know what? This is my last, or this is your last stock. I've got two left. I'm coming down there. I might lose this stock, but it doesn't matter because I'm gonna win the match. If you if you get back thrown off the ledge by Sheik as Falco, you almost always want to jump air dodge because even though she can wait for it with like a charge up smash or a charge down smash, that option is almost always better than jumping back into a needle. Yeah. Like, you don't, you, you don't want to get needle and you don't want to get narrowed. If you get either of those and you're forced to be, you're guaranteed dead. So you want to just take the up smash, force her to actually successfully execute a combo rather than uh, giving her the automatic kill by falling so low. Right, and Rula's starting out pretty strong with a lot of pressure, a lot of double shines. Oh. This is how the last game started. Rula started with a really good lead, but then Sweet just had such great edge guarding on him. Took two. Oh no! Oh, I uh, guess they're a little late. Isn't able to capitalize on the missed uh, lasers. Good decision right there. I like Sweet's use of down smash. I feel like a lot of players with Sheik try to just do too much, go for fancy combos. I mean, walk up down smash. It's a really good tool if you feel like the other person is going to press a button. Yeah, well, I mean, like Sheik is. People overcomplicate Sheik. Yeah, She's definitely. actually a really simple character. She does have a simple style. It just depends on how well you use it. I mean, every, every, every tool has its day. You can always use you know, her down air and her up air, but if you stick to the basics and play her efficiently first and fancy the second, you, you'll almost always perform better with her. 
Yeah, absolutely. All right, and uh, Sweet taking his first stock of the match here. He's at 122%, so he could die really, really easy from a narrow back air. Pretty much anything he feels like throwing out. Ooh. Is that back air? Goes for the down smash. You can actually tech that if you, uh, I believe you hold both sticks into the ground and then hit L when you're uh, on the ground. Or it's a. Uh, I actually know, just need to crouch cancel it. Just the crouch cancel. Just the control stick down and towards the stage. Towards the stage. And you have to tech before you hit the corner because if you hit the corner, you'll air dodge. Uh, but you have more than enough time. Even yeah. when you're on the corner, you have more than enough time. It's just uh, it's a neat tool to know if uh, if you specifically in this matchup because Falco likes to go for down smash as an edge guard more in this particular matchup than most. Yeah. But uh, it is a good tool to know overall. It works for many moves, like such as Sheik's Fair, Captain Falcon's Knee. Any move that sends you at a downward trajectory, yeah. you can almost always crouch cancel it into the stage. Lula's trying to play really pacing. He's like, I have the lead. I'm not going to give it to you. Oh. Ooh. Soft hit on that forward smash. It doesn't go just go for a back air. Uh, I mean, it would have been much more efficient just to go straight for a back air. Yeah, he, he's, he's having a little bit of trouble killing her, but it's not that big of a deal because he's not taking too much damage. Yeah, So that's true. as long as he's keeping the, his percent down, uh, it'll be good. Oh, that was a very risky down air. He hit her so early that she could have actually acted before he landed. So had Sweet noticed, he could have just grabbed them and backed them. All right, trades with an up tilt right there. Rula is putting on some insane pressure this game. Ooh. Sweet does not seem to have an answer for it. Great near out of shield. Great combo. All right. Can he finish it off? Oh, that was a great get up from the ledge. Ooh, dash attack. That's something that Spacey just wants you to do. They want you to try and dash attack. Yep, definitely. Because it's just such a punishable move. Oh, oh runs right back in. Trying to make that smash. clutch comeback, but unfortunately, he wasn't able to. I think what he was trying to do there was go in and get a grab. All right, so it's one one. Uh, I believe this is still winners because both of these players won their previous match or they were just in losers from the start. <laughs> uh, I, th I, be I believe this is loser semis of uh, yeah. their pool. All this right. is loser semis. I remember both of these guys losing. Or yeah, that's funny. You remember them both losing. I remember them both winning. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we go to Dreamland. This is a great Falco stage, as we've said many times throughout this broadcast. Right? It just gives Falco so much room to run around and shoot Sheik while still giving him the, the great platform heights for his combos. He lets Sheik get back on freely there, but ooh, great pivot grab. Yeah. I would see like, oh, ooh. no, R you Rula's hate to see this type of thing happen. Rula's a very aggressive Falco, and a stage like this can get Sweet the room he needs to react to that aggressiveness. Yeah. Unfortunately, now Rula has to play from behind, so now he has to chase Sweet, whether he likes it or not. Yeah. Hopefully he can get this stock quickly and recapture the lead. I'd like to see him play a little more aggressive. Uh, near the ledge, it's risky, but Sweet hasn't shown the ability to get up from the ledge with any type of invincibility. He does the really delayed wave lands or aerials, so if you can just space the up B and wait right outside the range of it, I think he could punish uh, Sweet's get up from the ledge a little bit better. But uh, He's doing great so far, so let's see if he can keep up this pressure. And I think Sweet needs to be a little bit, well, a lot more aggressive in general, oh. actually. Wow. That happened that three down times. Chain grab. It's a thing. New Falco meta 2014. New Falco meta. Oh, shine back air would have been great there out of shield. Oh, no. No, he says, all right, I messed that up. reaction by Sweet, so it's like, why are you up being in my face, bro? <laughs> yeah. I don't want your fire. Oh, great recovery, too. Sweet is really not cracking oh. under the pressure, which is nice to see of up-and-coming players. You don't want to see them uh, choke on the big stage. It's good to see them keep their composure in these settings. And Sweet's having some trouble getting those tech chases down. He does a forward smash punish. 
He's having some trouble getting those tech chases down, but he really wants to use them to rack up damage. I don't think he's looking for a kill off of them. He's just saying, okay, I can get the grabs on you, so I'm going to get as many as I can, rack up as much damage as I can before you do something like that. Yep, definitely. Oh, oh great tech chase. Punishes that missed tech with the neutral air. Oh. oh. All right, Rula goes on the offensive, but gets grabbed. Ooh, barely misses that drop forward air. Smash sweet off the stage. Oh my god, this is such an intense match. You can see the nerves in both players' gameplay right now. Ooh! Another forward kill, forward smash kill for Rula. All it's gonna take is a tilt in the fair, though. Yep. Ooh, and it's gonna. Ooh. Oh, he misses the double jump. See, now Falco's at a really awkward percentage for Sheik. She keeps barely missing the killing punish. There we go. There it is. Oh my god, last set. Last match. Tournament life on the line. Hype sickening. These players are so nervous. It's meant just so intense. You can see neither of them want to approach. They're just kind of like, ugh, please don't kill me. Yeah. Oh, nice smash out by Rula. It's really fast. It's a standing laser. He gets another grab. He's getting uh, these grabs pretty consistently right now. Just needs to get the follow ups. Oh, double spot wow. dodge to avoid the forward smash. Ooh, very nice run off back air. That was like four back airs there. Somehow yeah. Rula did not get hit. She's like, I am immune to your feet. 70 oh, 70. Back air. Oh, oh, no, oh, oh. no. There we go. Oh, oh boy. That's a risky situation right there. You don't want to get her. You don't want to fight her when she's coming off the platform. Yeah, this could be it. Oh, nice recovery. Nice ground tag. There we go. Oh, oh that's it. Good job to Rula and Sweet.